I had a young man who was about to go in college and he texted me and said, can I meet with you a little bit before I go? I'm like, sure, what do you wanna meet about? He said, well, before I go to college, I'm trying to take out as many people as I can and just ask them for a tip in this season of life. So, ah, what a great idea. I'm like, sure, count me in. So he set up a time, he met with me. He's like, okay, what tip do you have for me? I told him this. I said, here's what I want you to do. Don't be stupid. And he looked at me and he's like, what? Like, I think he was expecting something deeper or something more spiritual. I'm like, nope, that's it. Don't be stupid. And I told him, I said, look, you're a good kid. I've known you ever since you were a small fella. And you've got good parents, you've got good things going around you, and you know what to do. Like, you've got a heart that's sensitive to God. And throughout our lives, we'll go through things where we start violating our hearts. We start lowering our standards. It's like Satan comes to Jesus and says, hey, you're the son of God, throw yourself off this cliff and God will save you. No, that's stupid. I know it's stupid. I know that's tempting God. I know that's not a good idea, so why would I do it? But all the time in our lives, we find these excuses to just be stupid. Of, I got away with it last time, I can get away with it this time. Oh, it didn't hurt me this time, you know, like Samson with his head in Delilah's lap. It's like, ah, it didn't hurt me the last time, it won't hurt me this time. No, it's stupid. Every time you tell her, Samson, what the secret of your strength is, she attacks that very area. Don't be stupid, Samson. And the truth is, in all of our lives, we come across moments where it's just easy to kind of be stupid. And so today's tip is don't be stupid. Don't violate your heart. If your heart is leading you in a way, stay faithful to your heart, stay faithful to your values. Don't tempt God. God is trying to protect you. Don't be stupid.